everybody, Gabe here from the Hawaii Institute of Self-Reliance. Welcome back, thank you for watching. Today, I've got a poncho to review for y'all. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but it's the Tenji, of course made in China, nylon, 100% waterproof, ripstop material, poncho, shelter. It is 59 inches long and 55 inches wide. Um, there's a hoodie, of course. There's a zipper right here, which is really nice. And you can tighten up the hood. And I don't know if you can tell, but see the brim of my hat is fairly protected. So it's a pretty good size hood. So my hat might not get as wet. Right, I mean that's kinda nice. So, let's start off with these buttons. All right, this is pretty cool. Has a little button system right here. You can just take it off and have more breathing room, more, uh, more loose. You see I got my backpack on. It's a 50 liter backpack. And it covers it. Protects it, keeps it dry. And so this is unbuttoned. And these are the grommets. This is the one gripe I have with the grommets, you know, kind of small and might not do so well. But if you just use this as an emergency shelter and you're not using it as your everyday camp shelter, then I think that's not too bad. It works. It seems pretty tough. And I'm 5'10", so it covers my body pretty good. I don't know if you can really tell. And then the backpack's covered. Put this down. Okay, stick around and check out more and see how this turns into a shelter. And I will give you my opinion. Is it worth the $22? Stick around. This is the bag that the poncho comes in and it fits back inside. I've folded it up a couple times and, and managed to get it back in there without too much trouble. So I think it works. It's got a little, uh, what do you call it, a, a strap kind of thing, a hook thing right here to hang it on your backpack or something like that. And it works. It works good and it's made out of the same material as the poncho. Okay, I'm giving you a quick tour. I made it like this so I can gather water on that one side right there. And the rain is starting to come down. It works great for me as a poncho. I've had it for the past week and we've had a 
really gnarly rainstorm come in and it's been raining for about a week so I got this perfect perfect timing to test it out in the jungle it works great as camouflage it's a nice tough material it seems to be a hundred percent waterproof and I've hiked around you saw in the video so in the jungle things like the snag and tear things and there's just tons of it so this type of poncho doesn't last too long if it's poor quality and what I've noticed is it's of a decent quality for $22 you know 59 inches long 55 inches wide that's a pretty good shelter and like I said I'm 5 foot 10 so it covers me pretty good now yeah, I mean, it's nylon, it's, it's a waterproof ripstop nylon, it works good. Keeps me dry, or dry enough, as best I can ask. I hope you liked this video, I hope it helped you out. If you're looking for a poncho, uh, check, uh, I hope I'm saying it right, Jinji, or uh, it's J-T-E-N-G. Uh, so my Chinese isn't very good, but something like that. Kenji, Jinji, I, I don't know. Uh, but anywho, it works, especially for $22. Hope you like this video. Hope you comment. I'm here for any questions. Please subscribe, and until next time, aloha!